Hey everybody, what's up? This is IBZ Games, and welcome to my second video. Now, like how I said in my intro, I will be showing you how to how I code my animations. But this is only the second video, so I'll be I'll just be teaching how you code a basic animation. Now, like how I said, you will be teaching how to code a basic animation, and there will be parts. So this is like part one, part two, part three, part four, and so on. So today in this video, all we'll be doing, I will just be showing you and like how how the mouth moves. So let's start off by creating a new project. So click the create button and wait for your project to load. All right, now our pro now that our project has loaded in uh now so here's the, the thing now what you want to do keep the scratch guy do not delete him so um position him wherever you want him to go to go in your animation so let's just put him like right here and then also resize it so resize it to 150 all right good so 150 Okay, so now that we're here on my on the pro on the project, so go to the costumes page. All right, now you can choose which one you want it to be like talking. So it can be standing like this and talk, or it can be like standing like this and talk. I choose the first costume, so let's do it. Also, rename it first. So first, yeah, like that. Now, so you zoom in. And for the mouth, so you see how it's like that face. Like you can you can choose any face, but um to to get rid of the face, what you do? I know I mean the mouth. So go to the go use the fill tool, and uh use the color white to fill in the mouth. Now the mouse tool, the mouse selection tool, uh selects the whole head, and that's not really what we want. We don't want to have a headless cat talking, so we're just gonna use the fill tool for now. So go in the mouth, and you see, and when you hover your mouse over it, it actually blends in. So click it, and then, well, you have no more. It has no more mouth. Well, it has a mouth, but it's just it just blends in. All right. So now what you want to do is you grab the circle tool, and you want to change the color. So make it black, and you make it like a line. So you see how it's like that, and then you go like this and wait a minute why is it like this well to, well if you're wondering why i can tell you why so basically it's because um we're using the color black and uh the outline is four and black blends in with black so it makes it really thick and it can't it doesn't actually look like it can talk i mean like it could be like like it can be you can like try to open the mouth like with a black circle but um that doesn't really look realistic so i'll show you how it looks realistic so go to the color and color it in white so go here go to red and then turn it white so now it's white so now then yeah there we go so it's white now and now you use the mouse no no, no. so hold on let me try that again so you select it and then um make it so that color of it is white uh, so let's grab it and um give it an outline of a uh, two so right now you can't see it but um give it an outline of two so it looks like that all right that's good so now grab the mouth so uh, right here and position it where you want it to be and then you can stretch it out a little bit like that so yes you can like move the mouth position it where you want and then this part is where you grab so now this you need to be a little careful on you don't you don't really want to mess up so what you do is that you grab here and try to open the mouth and then if you have it like a perfect line it's gonna kind of go like this so be a little careful but this is on the second costume so we don't really need to worry about it so just uh just put it where it is 
and then if you hold on let's resize it back to two okay yeah so now you duplicate this costume so by right clicking and hit this duplicate button and ta-da it's duplicated all right now name this second um, second or instead you can just have the name like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so one then this can just be called two all right so you grab the mouth and then hold on, zoom in all right yeah so you have the mouth you grab it and then you just pull it out and like how i said when you do that the mouth kind of like moves with your mouse if it's like a line so be a little careful on this so like i'll just do a little bit like uh, this yeah and since it isn't really that even we can just move it so you grab the mouth and then put it where it was so if you go here float one and two yeah so simple as that now what you want to do and now duplicate this costume and do that again so grab the mouth and now you stretch it out yeah like that pretty simple okay so keep so do this three more times so his mouth his mouth is kind of like like all the way opened so um i'm just gonna cut until um i finish that all right, so um, I'm back from doing that, and um, as you see, uh, I actually did seven instead of six because um, if you go to the sixth costume, it's kind of a bit close, and that doesn't really look too good. So I decided to do seven costumes for his open animation where his mouth opens. So now we have the first part now we're gonna do the closing animations like if you don't do the closing animations his mouth is just gonna open it's just gonna cut back to being closed like automatic like and you don't want to just automatically just go back you actually want to see the animation of him close his mouth so well, well let's do that start, so start off by going to costume number two and right here so you could also name a first second third fourth because that's just gonna make more sense so i'm gonna actually do that so first and um again i'm gonna cut until i actually get there all right so i've just renamed them like first second third fourth fifth sixth seventh, and seventh so the reason why i'm doing this because like if it says like one two and like uh the two and two two that's just gonna look like 11 no like 12 22 and that, that's just gonna mess the whole thing up and it's just gonna look weird so i just decided to do first second third fourth because first two kind of makes a little more sense so now what we're gonna do is that um we're gonna we're gonna go back to the costume number two which is second right here and you what you want to do is that you want to duplicate it but uh Oh, no, hold on. No, I'm I meant a uh, costume number six, or you guys probably just did six. So for you, it'd be costume number five. But if you did seven, costume number six. So go to costume number six, and then duplicate it. So right click and hit duplicate. Now move move it down. So now it says uh, fifth six, six two. And then you go back up to to fifth. And then you and then you duplicate that, and then you put the that at the bottom, and keep doing this until you get to second. And um, here's here's a note: do not duplicate costume number one, which is first, and put that at the bottom at the end. Because then his mouth is going to be closed during the animation, and you don't really want his mouth to be closed while he talks. So keep doing this until you get to costume number two. So on second two. Alright, so I just finished duplicating all the other costumes. So now, if you scroll up, so here's his mouth closed when he isn't talking, then it opens.
and then it closes back up like this this and then this and the reason why um like how i said another reason why you didn't duplicate costume number one is because then his mouth will, he will be closed for a bit too long and that's not really what you want so go to costume number one and um so now that you have your basic costumes done now you can actually code it out so click the green flag no so head to the events category and drag out a green flag block so when green flag clicked now go to this category the loops where and you can choose forever loop or the repeat loop i'm just going to choose the repeat loop and then do uh repeat 25 times and then uh go to the costumes area which is called looks so head to the looks category and grab out a next costume block and put it in all right now <laughs> smash that green flag and see there you go it talks and if you want to go a little longer so just 25 and you go like um 40 and then also rename it uh, basic animation part one. All right, so repeat forty times. Click the green flag. See, his mouth act his mouth moves. So in the next video, I'll be showing you how you can control the speed on how he taught on how like the speed on how fast you want his mouth to move. So, that's all for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Also, share this video to your with your friends. So, this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it, and goodbye.